All right, we are back again with another video and it has been almost a year since I did the original to this series. I absolutely love this movie. I haven't seen it in years, but I wanna see how it holds up, especially the CGI, because I distinctly remember this movie having incredible CGI for the time. Today, we're checking out Pirates of the Caribbean 2, Dead Man's Chest. I hope that you guys are excited about this. I sure as heck am. Make sure that you all hit me up in the comment section. I always love being in the comment section for the first few hours that a video is posted. I'm replying to everybody. So if you have something that you wanna to talk to me about, I would love to talk with you guys about it down there. Also make sure that you guys leave a like on the video, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and let's just head right in. Is it just me or did these movies just get progressively darker as we went along? Out of context, the perfect song that would go with this right here is just a slipping through my, my fingers, fingers all, all the time. The Sorry, Mamma Mia, beach, summer. I need summer. Summer! Summer! Excuse me, ma'am. You actually can't be out here on this dock. We tried telling Sparrow about that last movie. Why in the world did we end off last movie for him to get away with not having to go to jail to immediately having the movie start with him having to go to jail? Was the ending of last movie just pointless? The warrant for the arrest of one William Turner. Now, Will, what in the hell did you get up? I'm acting like I don't know, but still. Will, what in the hell did you do this time? James Norrington, is he present? Oh, I forgot about him. He was such a big part of the last movie. I don't believe that was the answer to the question I asked. I'm gonna go ahead and say it, but this guy just gives me straight, short king energy in the worst way. And condemned to death. Uh, well. For which the punishment, regrettably, is also death. Eh, you're not the first person to try to kill us. Perhaps you remember a certain pirate named Jack Sparrow. Captain! How good do you think the writers felt about writing that line in? <laughs> a dead man's chest. Hey! Hey, oh, ho. Hey! Come on, you can spin a little bit there, Gibbs. Did they really have to cook this much with the soundtrack? I don't think so. But good God, I'm happy they did. Remember, y'all, this is a children's movie. I just saw his eyeballs. <laughs> oh, look, it's my YouTube career. Ah! Funny enough, my wife hates birds, so she probably would love this scene. Every single time, we have such an iconic entrance to the man, the myth, the legend, Jack Sparrow, Johnny Depp, how you doing? The fact that they let him keep his damn hat. I'm sorry, mate. That was Johnny Depp reminding everybody, yes, this is a children's movie. <laughs> Row my way to glory, baby. You got what you went in for then. Oh, 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 that's, that's what she, she said. said. Walk the what did the bird say? What is it with you and animals? First the monkey, then the bird. What is on that piece of cloth there? <laughs> See, monkey. No, that don't do no good. Wait, how is the monkey still cursed? Did it steal more gold? We're setting out to find whatever this key unlocks. No. That's too simple. Which we don't have without first having found the key what unlocks it. Is anyone sober enough to understand that? Should I even be asking that question? The captain seems to be acting a bit strange. Uh. I was about to say, specify that because there's never a time he isn't acting strange. Lord Beckett, the prisoner as ordered, sir. Oh, I remember you little gristle face. You're such a slimy What mark did he leave on you? That's a fair question, I'm curious. Somehow I doubt Jack will consider employment the same as being free. Freedom. There's so much that you can take away with that little tiny interaction right there. Being employed as being free, ooh. <laughs> I could literally just sit here and watch Jack Sparrow dick around for two hours and a half and be completely fine. <laughs> Why is the rum always gone? Cause it's in your stomach. You know, for some people, this is what they look like when they're down to go get some alcohol at the end of the night. Yeah, this is actually me on my way to go find a snack or Fruit Loops or something like that. You know, if there's a mysterious man on my ship that I don't know about, the last thing I'm gonna do is keep walking towards him. Bill Turner. Hey, I referenced Mamma Mia earlier. Flower power. You look good, Jack. The new dome. And to what do I have the pleasure of your carbuncle? He sent me. Who's he? Davy Jones. Ah, that he. Stood now here's there. a real question. Is that considered cannibalism? That. I mean, you're basically a sea life person yourself. Just saying. But the Flying Dutchman already has a captain, so there's really- Well, then it's the locker for you. What's the locker again? Drag the pearl back to the depths and you along with it. So there's no squeaking that contract? The black spot. So you really just gonna spot me and dip? You dick! I want to die! And you have a Plot logic, I'm just calling this out. The monkey in moonlight should be skeleton monkey. Why is he normal monkey? They are at nighttime. Oh, I forgot about that. 
That is terrifying. Me, I don't really have a problem with the open ocean, but if I saw something like that happen to a ship, no, I'd be my pants. I have faith in you, both of you. Honestly, I wouldn't. If it weren't for these bars, I'd have you already. <laughs> Honestly, that can be a kink for some people though. I need, I need to shut up. Oh God, help me Jesus. Captain Jack Sparrow, those me four doubloons. What is a doubloon? I've always heard that used as a payment method. I know pounds, I know euros, but what is a doubloon? When you find him, will you give him a message? I mean, I can, but you gotta specify where you want me to slap it. But you find a ship there, a ship with black seals. I love his accent. Oh my God, I want to hear an entire audiobook from him. Black seals. Oh, that's so Jamaican accent. Bon voyage, monsieur. You literally just rode me halfway. I could have almost swam there myself. Now, how in the world did they get that ship to come ashore like that? That's when you know hell has broken loose. The fact that a pirate would leave behind their personal stash, hell no. When I tell you that got me so bad in the movie theaters when I saw that for the first time. I can do this all day. No, that's Captain America's line. I can do this all day. Yeah, I know. I need to see more movies about these island people because they do exist where you will not come back alive if you end up where they're at. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? I wasn't surprised then, I'm not surprised now. <laughs> Why do they all have such tragic haircuts? They all got the coconut head treatment. They've been beating you up all day. Hey, when you're me, you'll take any attention you can get. Unique, simp step. What is the definition of a eunuch? I've never actually looked that up, but they reference that all the time in these movies. Bolicky licky. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> what, do you think she's a dog? A fair trial for Will ends in a hanging. Then there is nothing left for you here. I can't blame him for that. That's just a dad trying to save his daughter. Captain. I know you were trying to be dramatic, but you really just sat there holding that knife in his neck for how long? I'm afraid currency is the currency of the realm. That sounds like bullshit. I'm here to negotiate. Send in your second see if they can set the record straight. Now I get where Hamilton got their inspiration from. There's more than one chest of value in these waters. Oh, that's right. That's what he wants, Moses. Davy Jones's heart. Okay, I was about to say, why does he need the compass in the first place yet? He's only going to Jack. Oh, really? I'll still want that compass. But the papers are signed. What the f can you do about that now? Haha, <laughs> you two. What's going on? I missed you all. You know you can't read. It's the Bible. You get credit for trying. <laughs> that's adding every Christian everywhere. <laughs> Must have seen a catfish. That's actually a good joke. <laughs> All right, now y'all ruined it. Now, how in the world do you two expect to be able to push that boat out to sea by yourselves? Am I the only one calling logic plot here? Oh, well, you really shouldn't have. That skews me out way more than it should. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Literally, why? That gross, uh, why? What are you trying to do? They'll roast him and eat him. Are you just okay with the fact that he just tried to bite your fingers off? These cages we're in weren't built till after we got here. That's f***ed up. My boogie snickle snickle, all wood. Do you know any of what you're saying right now? <laughs> what do you expect? How in the world did the East India Trading Company get all the way out here? Wanted to make sure I tasted good. If I were him, at that stage, I probably would have just bolted. When you look at it from the side, that looks like a pair of hanging balls. It'll take all of us to throw the black ball. About six would do. Why would you say that? Oh dear. You're such a dumb <laughs> They're the kids in class that ruined it for everybody. Oh. Why did you all like- Y'all are dumb, you deserve that. <laughs> nice knowing ya. That's what happened to cheaters. Ah, five five. Ah. Oh, that's the first word that kind of made sense. Five five fire, yeah. Now what the f does Maliki Licky mean? <laughs> You're fanning the flames, stop blowing! <laughs> Run, oh, roll, God. I don't care, get the f out of there! <laughs> I always thought this was the funniest thing. <laughs> <laughs> Left the guy. You all better keep going! <laughs> hey, he's not tall enough! <laughs> what are you waiting to eat? His thumb? <laughs> I think you just pissed off the wrong woman. How none of them got hurt, zero idea. They made a jack kebab. 
Do you all just go do what anyone says to you at any point in time? No wonder you all are stuck on this island. <laughs> he was this close, this close to sticking that landing, but his kebab got the best of him. <laughs> How close to death is he at any given moment in time? I'd say like 95%. Ah, Excellent, the work have done. We've done it for you. Those two are the biggest swindlers of all time. They immediately switch camps. Test off the line. Hurry the f up, you one-eyed loser. Good doggy. That's so sad they left the dog behind. Remember is the day that you almost that was the writers, and that was the audience coming in as the ocean. You all left the dog behind, now he's gonna take your place. Trifling need, fleeting, as in, say, a passing fancy. As in a need, as in I need to go. It's gonna save Elizabeth. You're not gonna question that at all? You're getting played while knowing you're getting played. And you? Female presence amongst us, yes, sir. I can just look at somebody and tell they just have a terrible natural body odor, and that is that man. I want you to search the ship and find her. She's probably naked. New kink on <laughs> the Kraken. Oh, the musical themes in this movie are disgusting. Now inseparable we are. Well, have been before. If you're not even confident, then how do you expect us to be? Find the boat. I mean, no offense, but you left the one guy with his tongue cut out to mind the boat. What if he has to tell you all something? What's he gonna do? Just like wave? Really? I'm just, I'm just saying. Look, an undead monkey. The fact that he just immediately shoots the monkey. Well, the sea sums the dichotomy of good and evil. What in the hell? You've been reading too much from the Bible. Same story, different versions, and all are true. It's ironic because it actually is true because she is the same. Yeah. He couldn't literally put his heart in a chest, could he? It's a Pirates of the Caribbean movie. Of course he f could. Let me see your hand. Now you are way too smart for your own good. Do you think she realizes that he just casually steals all of her while he's in there? Dirt. This is a jar of dirt. Now how is that not a TikTok meme? <laughs> oh, that's such a good transition. You love to see it. Again, Will's stupid. He's literally accepting his fate to go over there by himself. Where's the brains at all in this movie outside of Jack? Beneath this foul breath. Yeah, this is the part in the horror movie when you leave the house. God, that is just disgusting. What a cool intro. Man, that's so good. Oh, the crew looks disgusting in the best way. Anybody ever have fish sticks? Kind of the same concept. This CGI job for Davy Jones is one of the best I have ever seen. Don't listen to him. You know, your hand's shaking like that doesn't really show me your resolve. Feel dead. Take my chances, sir. Damn, I never noticed that the blood actually spurted out. This is a PG-13 movie. You are neither dead nor dying. Oh, that's what you all are saying to my YouTube career. Oh, brother! Jack Sparrow sent me to settle his debt. April Fool's joke, best I got. <laughs> Ugh, another good transition! Price. What is that? I've never understood. What is that little... 100 souls. How in the holy f*** is he worth 100 souls? He's in love. Choose to be married. Honestly, I don't know if that would piss him off or make him feel worse for the kid. Can you condemn an innocent mind, a friend? It's Captain Jack Sparrow. His mum is the condition in which these souls need be. Again, already within two seconds, he's already thought of a loophole. The bloody f genius. He's trying to give a sign. This is your all signs to stop believing in ghost stories. Over there. Look for a sign! Your ship's literally on fire, and that's not sign enough for you? What's that over there? How in the world did she know to go to Tortuga? Was she just assuming that Jack would eventually show up there? Pretty fair assumption, but I'm still curious. And I don't give a rat if I live or die. Perfect! The pursuit cost me my crew. Jack, you might want to get out of there. It sounds like this guy has a grudge and he's going to collect. Commodore? No, not anymore. Weren't you listening? You know, you may not be the Commodore anymore, but you could at least take a bath. So do I make your crew or not? I don't think you can make it to the ship. <laughs> Double time! <laughs> this is why I love <laughs> Tortuga. <laughs> Why does she instantly get into that fight? There was no need for her to do that. Thanks, mate. Oh, God. Jack, you just killed him. I just wanted the pleasure of doing that myself. All right, that sounds good to me. That guy. Oh, 
literally in the pig slop. Well, you know, I would say it would smell worse, but I think that's just pretty much adding to the same. Now, how in the f did you know to go to Tortuga? Come on in with that beat there, Davey. You know, honestly, if you took the Phantom of the Opera but put it on C, it'd be this. Taco Mr. Tana! Which one? You need to specify. <laughs> oh, damn. It's my son. Well, now it's really like Mamma Mia just replaced daughter with son. So we get nothing but no, I won't. The cut out of the vine, Mr. Turner. How did I never catch on that he said that phrase? That sounds so goofy now that I think about it. <laughs> my cat's out of the vine, Mr. Turner. <laughs> that would hurt like a I would say who hurts you, Davey, but I do know. You had it easy, boy! That's easy? I do not want to know what goes on in your bedroom. To understand what you did was an act of compassion. I mean, debatably, yes. End up like we're with him. So what happens after the hundred years? Do they just get to go free or are you literally just part of the ship at that point? Like, look at how good that CGI is. Kids movie, but just disgustingly good. I've seen people vomit before, but that was the definition of projectile. Elizabeth, hide the rum. <laughs> hide the rum. Davy Jones. <laughs> Will you stop vomiting? I can't help it if your standards are lax. You smell funny. I've been saying that from the beginning. There is a chest. Oh dear. Can someone push him overboard? Even though we're not even on the ship yet. You don't actually believe him, do you? Who's she gonna trust? The drunk former Captain Norrington that's projectile vomiting? Or Jack that might have an option? Unique here having the meaning of broke. I feel like he's the Reddit of this movie. <laughs> that's Mr. one of my King. favorite shots. Don't you agree? I assure you. Oh, you without a wig just doesn't look the same. Your influence in London and your loyalty to the East India Trading Company. Is that it? I challenge Davy Jones. You sure about that, Will? You didn't want to challenge shark head scissor hands over here? How do you know the key? That's not part of the game, is it? That's a good line right there. Go ahead, Will. You don't get that many of them. Also, does anyone actually know how this I game mean, is played? Reggie. I've never known for the entire time I've watched this movie. Seven, five. Okay, now I'm starting to get it a little bit. That makes a little more sense. Maybe I'm just stupid. I'm so confused. Welcome to the crew. 12 fives. Ah, uh, you dummy. Feel free to go ashore. The better next time we make pop. To be fair, he just has to wait out 10 years, so it's not forever. Still sucks, but you know. The amount of cojones on Will to literally try to steal this key from under this guy's tentacles is astounding. You are stressing me out. I even know how this ends and you're still stressing me out. That whole scene is just really good. Oh no, you helped me. What more can they do to me? Honestly, that's true. Cause they want him to keep his arms and his legs, you know, just inflict pain. I really don't know what they could do to punish him. Lord Cutler Beckett of the East India Trading Company. Ah. That's my face when I look at him too. Full pardon. Commission is a privateer on behalf of England. Okay, now that's where the movie's just having movie logic again. You wouldn't keep that information to a down low, not try to say it in front of anybody out there that might want another pardon on this ship. A ship full of pirates. <laughs> that's twice my heart's been broken today. You never wondered how your latest fiance ended up on the Flying Dutchman in the first place. Fair point. And you have actually no idea if he did or didn't. That's a plot line that just did not need to happen because it just made everybody think, oh, that might actually be kind of interesting. Pirates, or worse. This could have been a lot better, but then of course, the worst had to happen. Watch this. You just had to say, what more could they do to you? This is what? A Kraken! God, I still get goosebumps on that. What happened? Must have hit a reef. No, you just hit a thing that's about to swallow you whole. Oh, a this Mean green in an alien machine. It's a mean green mother from outer space. That music is everything. What are you doing, you idiot? Pick up a axe. That's what you get. I don't even know what to say. This is just utter chaos in the best way. It's nice knowing y'all. I'll see you at the bottom of hell. They hit him with a beat too. Oh, that's its mouth. Oh, that's so gross. Damn, that thing looks crazy. Of course, hide, hide, hide right now. He must have been claimed by the sea. I am the 
sea. Also, that doesn't help me because that means my key is still out in the sea. Man, this movie really did just kill the game on the transition shots. We are very much alike, you and I. Except personal hygiene. You're complaining about how I smell when you've been talking to Commodore Norrington, who literally was in pig schlop? To do the right thing. Definitely not foreshadowing anything. I love those moments. I like to wave at them as they pass by. Straight into hell. And when you do, you'll discover something, that you're a good man. That's definitely not foreshadowing something. You won't be able to resist. They just need to get it over with. She was there, I'm sorry, but she was literally right there about to kiss him anyway. Oh, what you to You can accept it at this point or not. I'll trust you to know what awaits you should you fail. Is that what you want to say to the people that are literally in charge of saving your damn heart? I've said it before and I'll say it again. Look at the f shots of this movie. Oh yeah, that looks like a chest that would definitely, well, I mean, literally on the front of it, the key is literally a heart. I was gonna say, maybe they'll just keep it a little bit of a surprise. No, it's so obvious. You actually were telling the truth. Yeah, people are always surprised. <laughs> After you tricked me onto that ship to square your debt with Jones. Somebody say something? Did somebody say something? Because if Jones is dead, who's to call his terrible beastie off the hunt, eh? Well, technically you should let him do that because then he would be in charge of the Dutchman and then he could. So sorry. I knew you'd warm up to me eventually. Hang on, the office. I got it. Everybody just calm down. Oh, I prefer to see it as the promise of redemption. What a bar! Guard the chest! <laughs> that is so like her. If we was any kind of decent, remove temptation from their path. I like the way you're thinking there. I hate! Sorry, sweetie, literally no one cares. Why would you all run that way? Run the other way. Now everybody on this island is just royally f This isn't meant to be a sign for you all to come up here. Stay down there and fish hell. By your leave, Mr. Norrington. Well, you think you're real tiki, don't you? Also, who built that church? I think he created parkour before parkour. Parkour! This is so stupid, it's genius. Hi, can you imagine how much that would hurt? Oh, you forgot to check that you even had your sword? Yeah, your all's guess is as good as mine. I've been watching it and I don't know how we got here. Oh, you idiot. Just leave it, leave it, get out of there, leave it. Oh, we got that main team coming back in. That is such a cool shot. Now that is what you call teamwork. Nice shot. For how crusty Davy Jones looks, that heart looks pretty normal. The double thrust behind. You have a sword in your pocket, use it. Can you imagine how much you'd vomit after being in something like that? Right. You shouldn't be walking right now, let alone trying to fight. The fact that he figures this out is insane. God, right to the head? Do you know how much that would hurt? You all couldn't give us five minutes. Five! Hey, fish face! Gunjali! <laughs> That's gonna hurt in the morning. Enough! You might want to get below deck. Don't blow it out in my ship! I've always wanted to say that. That's just like a machine gun version of that. That's cheating. Against the wind, the Dutchman beats us. That's how she takes her prey, but with the wind. Yeah, but did you all forget about the other advantage the Dutchman has? Well, it was nice knowing you before the Kraken. We must have hit the reef. Why do you always think it's a reef? Steady. Well. Can we shoot this big shrimp? Anybody want some calamari? Whatever you do, don't miss. No pressure or anything. I don't care where it is in the movie. I don't care what time. I am always obsessed whenever they bring in that main theme again. Then load the rum. Are you mad? Literally everybody has to make sure. Hey, the rum too. I'd rather die. Has no one noticed that Jack's on a little boat by himself right now? Ah, there it is. Ooh, God, it's pissed. It's really pissed. Were we not? Oh my God, this looks like a Sam Raimi horror movie. 
<laughs> yeah, where's that compass pointing to, bud? Literally, I can hear Jim Carrey saying, What, what is the, the deal? deal? Oh, God. And see, now you're stuck. <laughs> this was a children's movie? Look at the shot and the music coming in, Jack! See that? Now that is fried calamari. Abandon ship or abandon hope. I don't even know what I would do in this scenario. I mean, obviously you gotta leave, but you're just rolling the dice. Or you pull an Elizabeth. Now how are you gonna talk your way out of that one, huh? Come on, Will, step two! I'd be more than a little confused at that moment. Pirates. You really gonna turn me up? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Where's Jack? They like to stay behind to give us a chance. Yeah, well, y'all are still getting married, right? No amount of Jack Sparrowing is gonna get you out of this one. I'm surprised he didn't just go to chop off his own hand. I'm surprised he didn't. That's revolting. Also so bad? No, you're just the embodiment of a human booger right now. What an absolute bad ass. You all did this to him, especially Elizabeth. But all of you agreed to it. Even when you thought you got the best of him, baby, Jack Sparrow's not going anywhere! Oh, look at the flies around that heart. I mean, you all can be mad about it, but at the end of the day, you all agreed to this. Will you sail to the ends of the earth to fetch back with your job? I mean, that sounds like a sequel to me. Aye, aye, aye. What happened to your accent? This still gives me goosebumps to this very day. Oh, what a day. What a lovely day. What's become of my ship? Let's go, baby. <laughs> All right, so that was Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chess. I love that movie. I might even say that I love that more than the original. Is it as concise and to the point? No, but I do enjoy the villain of Davy Jones even more than Barbosa because I think there's more layers to his character. And I love all the interweaving plot lines. I love the way they set up for the next one. The next one is definitely the weakest of the trilogy, I think. If you guys like what you saw here today and you want to see more, let me know down in the comment section. Remember, I'm there for the first few hours that the video goes live, responding to everybody that says something down there so if you want to talk to me give your opinions on the video or anything else i love to respond to you all down there also do not forget to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see me do the third parts of the caribbean let's get this video up to 2500 likes you get it up to 2500 likes then we will do the next parts of the caribbean at world's end i love you all make sure that you check out my patreon if you want to see the full uncut link reaction to this and all other movies and tv shows covered on the channel as well including exclusive content like my vlog over to london with all of my movie commentator friends and don't forget to check me out on my twitch I stream every single time a new video goes live and on Wednesdays at 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. Besides all that, I will Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest, you all in another one. <laughs>